As you breathe in, think of the breath sweeping through the body, getting rid of all the cobwebs, all the dust. In other words, all the little bits of tension that creep into the body in the course of the day. Here it is, we're just starting the day, but people have been running around. There tends to be a lot of tension around the meal, the pre preparation of the meal. So let it disperse, let it disband. Let the breath sweep through, sweep through. It's something you've got to do every day, because things creep up in the mind without, without realizing them all too often. Greed comes in and it takes just a little tiny beachhead. Anger comes into a little tiny spot. Then it waits until we're a little bit complacent, and then it grows. So it's best to get these things when they're small. And start looking back on the mind. Okay, what is the mind that wants to keep on creating these things? Why is that? It's when you pose this question in the mind that you start seeing things you didn't see before. If you simply take it for granted, well, that's the way it is, then nothing's going to get changed. Think about gravity. For a long time, people said, well, why do things fall? What's their nature? In other words, it's just the way it is. No knowledge came out of that. It's when stop, someone started questioning it that they learned things about gravity that they could use to lots of good purposes. So when anger comes in, don't simply take it as normal. I mean, it may be normal, but it's not good for the mind. Ask yourself, why is it there? And keep sweeping, 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 to the point where you get tired of sweeping up its dirt. Traditionally, they say that sweeping the monastery is a good way to give rise to discernment. And one of the things you learn, of course, is that as long as the trees are creating leaves, they're going to be sweeping them. Now, with trees, we like to have their leaves. There was one monk I knew in Bangkok who hated sweeping the monastery, and so he cut all the trees down. That's not a solution outside, but it can be a solution inside. What are the, what's creating all this dirt in your mind? What's creating all the dust? Look for that. That way you find that you learn a lot of things about yourself that you didn't know before. Some things you wouldn't like seeing, but it's better to know them than not to know them. Always have that attitude. That too will help you see things that are long remain hidden. This is how we keep cleaning up the mind.